Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So I'm actually really happy to announce that later on this month, so September 2019, me and my mum will be heading off to Orlando, Florida for a very special holiday. Now during that holiday we will actually be staying on site at Universal Orlando Resort and we will uh, obviously be doing Universal and all of the Universal parks but we are also doing Universal Orlando's Halloween event, Halloween Horror Nights. And so with that being said, I'm going to be doing what I'm calling a Before the Fear Universal Orlando Halloween Horror Nights FAQ video. And this is obviously just my first initial thoughts on the event prior to going, but I still thought this would be a pretty good video to do so that I can compare my thoughts of the event after I have been. The first question that I am getting asked quite a lot about Halloween Horror Nights this year is are you excited for it and it's a very simple question with a very simple answer and that answer is yes. I do not get to go to Halloween Horror Nights very often at all. I don't get to go every year, I'm not a local, I am from the United Kingdom but my gosh uh, if I can get there for Halloween Horror Nights I will. Um, not only do I love Halloween and I love autumn but I just love the atmosphere around the Universal Orlando parks around that time of the year. This is going to be really obvious, but I'm excited for the event because I love myself a bit of gore. I love myself a bit of horror, you know? So, yeah. Question number two is, have you ever been to the event before? Yes, I have. It was back in 2015. So, yeah, it was four years ago. And... During that time, I only got to do one house, and that was Freddy vs. Jason. Uh, and I wanted to do more, but my mum, uh, unfortunately, wasn't very well. She wasn't feeling too good that night, and so we didn't get to utilise Horror Nights as much as I would have liked. So yes, I have been before, but um, I didn't get to experience the full Horror Nights vibe, I guess. Question number three. What is your most anticipated house for this year? Okay, I have actually two houses that I am really excited for and I think these are going to be really obvious houses but that is the Ghostbusters house and the Stranger Things house. Another house that I'm quite excited for at the moment is also Jordan Peele's Us. Question number four is, is there a house that you are particularly scared to do? Yes. And that house is Killer Clowns from Outer Space. And it might seem a little bit silly because it's actually the more uh, comical, I think, of, of all of the houses that have been announced. But honestly, clowns are one of my biggest fears. So when I do that house, I'm actually facing a pretty big fear of mine. So yeah, out of all of them, Killer Clowns from Outer Space is the house that I'm mostly scared for. Moving on now to question number five, and that is, is there a house that you are least excited for? Yes, even though I guess this is kind of um, a nasty question in a way because I haven't been to the event yet. But I think the one house that I am least excited to do is probably Yeti, Terror of the Yukon. I feel like I've just completely butchered that name, but yeah, that's the house I'm least excited for. I don't know why, I think it's just because I don't quite get the same vibes with the Yeti house as I do with all of the others that have been announced. But hey, maybe that'll change. I might come back from the event and say, wow, that was actually one of my most favourite houses. Who knows? Question number six is, which scare zone are you most excited for? This is actually a really, really easy one, and that is the Anarchade scare zone. It's 80s inspired, it's obviously inspired by arcades. I've seen a few clips of this scare zone because I couldn't help myself. I was super, super excited. I love all of the neon that seems to be around that scare zone. So yeah, that is definitely the scare zone I'm most excited for. That then leads me to my next question, which is, do you have a scare zone that you are least excited for? Yes, that scare zone for me at the moment is Rob Zombie Hellbilly Deluxe. I don't know what it is about this scare zone, I really don't. At the moment, I'm just not feeling it. Moving on now to question eight, is there a scare zone that you are particularly scared to go through? No, not at the moment. 
So question number nine is actually about my mum because my mum is going with me away on holiday and she will also be doing Halloween Horror Nights with me too. And one of the biggest questions that I get about my mum is, is she excited for the event like you are? I think she is excited, but Halloween Horror Nights was always an event that I always pushed us to do and it was an event that I always wanted to do whereas I think my mum although she is excited for it I think she would quite happily go away to Universal Orlando Resort and not do Horror Nights but yeah I think she is excited. Question number 10 is does my mum have a house that she is excited for the most? Her house that she is mostly really excited for is the Killer Clowns from Outer Space house and honestly, I think she's mostly excited for that house because she knows that that's the house that I am mostly scared to do. Alright, so question number 11 is, did any announcements take you by surprise for this year's event? Yes, going back to Killer Clowns from Outer Space, I know last year in 2018 it was a scare zone and I was quite surprised that this year they announced it as a house. Is there a franchise you think shouldn't have been in the event this year? Honestly, no. Looking at all of the scare zones that were announced, all of the houses that have been announced, there's a lot of stuff going on this year and honestly I feel like nothing is out of place and I definitely don't think at the moment that any franchise shouldn't be in the event. So that is it. That is my Before the Fear Universal Orlando Halloween Horror Nights FAQ. Are you particularly excited for the event? Do you think that this year is going to be good? Is there any houses or scare zones that you're particularly excited for or ones that you're not so excited for? Let me know in the comments section down below. Thank you so, so much for making it to the end of this video. I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to leave it a big thumbs up. If you are new here, go and click on that subscribe button. Thanks for watching once again and I hope to see you in my next video.